Well, you can rent anything these days. Houses, cars, furniture, even goats. Yes, I said goats. There's a company I found simply called Parker County Goat Rental. But these goats are not rented for leisure. They are hard at work clearing land, preventing wildfires, and even ridding properties of invasive species like poison ivy. And I got to see them in action on one of their job sites. <laughs> 65 goats, all released onto an overgrown piece of land. Oh. With one job. Eat as much of the plants and vegetation as they can stomach. The goats, all employees of Parker County Goat Rental owner Nathan Alford. They never call in to work. They work Thanksgiving Day, Christmas Day. Don't ask for a raise. So they're, they're pretty good employees. So. <laughs> Their purpose today, clearing this overgrown piece of land photographer Dixie Dixon wants to use for photo shoots. And then basically put a pond down here that, that uh, when they have music videos and shoots and things like that, they can shoot around a pond. Dixie is a Nikon ambassador who shoots for Western brands and clients all over the world that are often looking for unique locations. And we had all this property, but it was so built up by brush and everything like that. And I thought, how do we go about clearing all this land without, you know, we didn't want to destroy the cool beauty of the property. So she hired the goats to clear away the thick brush, open up the area, and even help prevent wildfires and invasive species like poison ivy and poison oak. Yeah, that's the beauty of it. And the goats just eat it right up. They're not allergic to it or anything like that. So they're going to clear all that out so that we can create some trails along the property. They not only eat the seeds, so therefore it helps with weed abatement and reproduction of, of weeds. So whereas if you mow it conventionally, then uh, you're just spreading, spreading seeds at that point. The goat droppings also serving a purpose. So with their manure, it puts healthy bacteria back into the soil for good native grasses to grow. So it's a win, win, win all the way around. The herd is rented out to 12 different job sites currently, and they're always paired with at least two great Pyrenees dogs. Friendly to people, but not to coyotes, the goat's biggest predator. They do an extremely good job of keeping these goats protected. Allowing the goats to eat worry-free, taking the property from this to this in just two days. We've been really blown away by the process and it's uh, it's been such a fun adventure to see the goats at work doing their thing. These goats could serve a much bigger purpose than just being, you know, household pets, farm pets. They could they could actually do something to prevent wildfires, rid properties of poison ivy and do other things. Oh yeah. No, they're they're definitely good animals and they do a good job of what they do, but eco friendly and you can even bring one in the studio with you. <laughs> How much can they eat like a day, you know? like Two days to clear a property, right? Yeah. I mean, so yeah. Two to four percent of their body weight. Oh two to four God, yeah, per, can you imagine? And no. you have 1,200 that you're going out there? Like the, the, is that we said 1,200, is that right? Yeah, mm -hmm. 1,200. Uh, wow, that, that's that's a whole lot. So, um, and, and we don't have a name for this one yet? No, 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 no name. I mean, should we name it fair. Billy? We that's might name it Billy the Goat. Billy the Goat, Billy the Goat. by the way, Billy was watching all of his friends on TV and yes, he was like, he, where are my other friends this morning? And he was fascinated. Yeah. Yeah. His friends are on TV. I'm sorry oh. we couldn't bring them with us. Yes. I think it's really cool that this is one of the only companies, or if not the only company, like this in North Texas. Yeah, yeah. it is really cool that you've started this and, and had such a great success. Oh, yeah. And, and staying busy, too. Oh, yeah. yeah. All, right. All right. Well, well Nathan, hello. thank you for being well, here. Hello. Thank you for bringing the goat, too. I think we've got two new friends for the goat, Carmen <laughs> and Scott, for sure. For, sure. for life. And yes, we'll be we right are. back with more CBS News Texas. You like These